Okay, so to start we're gonna do the main brief of the song and what we are gonna do is the following. <laughs> It's gonna do that. So we're gonna to go to the uh, to the A string. We're gonna to go to the second fret. We're gonna strike it twice, and then what we are gonna do is we're gonna do that. So on the uh, on the same string, it's second fret, fourth, and fifth. And then what we're gonna do? We're gonna strike on the fifth one time, and then we're gonna strike again. And we're gonna do a pull off to the fourth position, or you can do a slide five to four or five pull off to four. And then we're gonna strike four again and we're gonna do a slide or a pull off from four to five and everything is gonna be on the A string. Let's go one more time, slow tempo. And then we start again. Okay, so with the main verse, um, we're gonna repeat the uh, the verses. It's always the same section. Uh, we're gonna do uh, we're gonna use two, uh, two two chords. It's gonna be E and A. Okay. Now with the E, we're gonna do the following. We're gonna do that. So we're gonna do open string, uh, open E string. We just uh, strike it one time, and then we're gonna go to seven on the A. 9 on the D, 7 on the G, and B, uh, on the 9 on the B. That's the chord, it's an E chord. And we're gonna strike uh, all the strings at the same time, twice. And then what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to, we're gonna remove this finger, and we're gonna go to 7, 7, and 7 of the, uh, of the 7, of the 4th, uh, I'm sorry, to the 5th, 4th, and 3rd. Strike just one time and then go back to the original chord seven, nine, and seven. That's the movement. And then, what we're gonna do, we're gonna do that. We're gonna strike doing palm muting, open string, open E string, and the seventh position of the, of the, uh, of the A string so twice, then strike the whole chord. Uh, do palm muting twice, whole chord again, and this one is optional, and strike one one more time with the palm muting. One more time, and then we're gonna do that. So seven of the E string, hammer on to the nine of the of the um, of the E string, and then seven of the A and nine on the E time and then we're gonna go to an A chord it's the same principle we just strike on the on the fifth of the uh, of the E string one time and then we're gonna do that it's seven seven of the uh, D and A and sixth of the uh, six of the G string twice we uh, go to five and five and then go back to the main chord seven and six And then do the same thing we did with the with the E chord. Strike uh, twice on the seven and the five, doing palm muting, then whole chord, palm muting with seven and five, whole chord, and the with the optional one, seven and five with palm muting one more time. And it's the same lick, the same movement we did before. And then we just move to the uh, to the to the second round. And now the second round, uh, it's pretty much the same thing. There's a slight change. We're gonna start the same the same manner we did with the other one. Uh, so um, until that part, same thing. Same thing we did before. Then palm muting, whole chord, palm muting, whole chord. Same thing we did before. And now the uh, the one that was optional, the seven with the uh, with the uh, palm muting. We're not gonna play that. We shouldn't do that. One 
One more time. One more time. And then we go again to A and we repeat the same thing we did before. Okay, and then the uh, next section comes in. Okay, so the next section it's a little bit different. It's it's going to be the third round on the core on the verses, and we're going to do the following. We can do that. So uh, at the beginning it's the same thing with 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 E, open string on the on the um, on the E chord, E G string, open E, open E. Then same thing we did before, whole chord and seven, and back to E. And then we do that. We're gonna go to seven on the E string, seven, okay? We just strike one time, then strike it again, go to nine on the E string, seven off the A, and then strike again, seven, hammer on to nine, pull off back to seven, nine on the E string, and seven on the A string. And we end with, with that position. Let's go one more time. time then we repeat the same thing we did with E and we're gonna change it it's gonna be pretty much the same thing but we instead of starting with the uh, seventh position we're gonna start with on the fifth okay so we go to five uh, on the on the E string five again same thing we did with E with, the, with seven five five and then same thing, nine, seven, seven hammer on to nine, pull off back to seven, nine on the E, and seven on the A. Let's go one more time. Let's go uh, the this whole last section, and that's pretty much about it, because that's the whole song. And then we just go back to the main riff. Now notice that we are doing this on the uh, on the on, on E and uh, with the A chord. Now you can do the same thing, and this is uh, this is extra. Is gonna we can do we can do it right here with the E chord and with an A chord. It's gonna be the same movement we did right here, but on this position. Same thing. Starting from the second fret of the E string, and then we go to A. Same thing. And now with the final part. The, uh, well, with the original one, we start on the seven, so we start on the second, and with the second, uh, the second phase, we're gonna go to E to the five. Instead of starting with five, we're gonna start with an open A string. So basically, it's the same idea. The only thing is that we are we are doing it right here. And that's pretty much the whole song. If you got these um, this, this sections, you're going to be able to play uh, along the, uh, the original track.